This is a new Ultra Turn from Ajax Machine Tools. What features have we got on this model? Uh, this is a brand new um, machine out of uh, the portfolio of machines from a Spanish manufacturer we've been working with for 25 years. Um, this is a no frills uh, entry level CNC stroke manual machine where you've got um, the full CNC cycles on a control from full conversational so you don't have to know the G code and the M code programming. Um, it's very simplistic to operate and you've got handles so you can wind it as well uh, as a full manual machine. Mm -hmm. And you say it's no frills, it's still got a programmable uh, tool base though? Uh, yes it has um, and we, we like to put extras onto machines as a standard. Um, everybody can offer a, a CNC machine, a flatbed CNC machine with a quick change tool post. Um, the advantage that we've got is we can put the four station automatic tool post on this model. We can also put an eight station turret on it as an, as an option and um, different models that we have when we're going up the range uh, offer slightly different specifications where you've got more options that you can put on as a, as a modular machine. And for the people that haven't used this control before, does it come with training? Uh, we can offer training as a package. Um, installation training always comes as a package on any of our machines. Um, a lot of people are not familiar with the Fagor control. Um, it is probably the fourth out of the four controls that, that are offered on standard machines, the standard programming formats, which would generally be Fanuc, Heidenhain, Siemens. Um, but there's also Fagor. Um, other than that, you've got the PC-based systems out there, but we say that there's four industry standard controls mm -hmm. and we can actually fit Siemens on this machine as well. Okay, so I haven't got to have a fake or I could have Siemens instead? Yes, you can have a, a Siemens 808 control, which is a stripped back control. Uh, as the Fagor is an 8037 control, um, you've still got the same uh, can cycles in there, but it's just they strip things out to build it at the price that we're looking at. Okay, I think it's fair to say it's not for everyone, this machine. If you're doing lots of volume components, it might not be for you. But how about for the other people? Uh, well, this is a machine which literally can go into any workshop, um, from Fred in his shed to the multinationals and the blue chip companies. Um, yes, they, a lot of them can have multi-million pound machines, but they want a small jobbing machine in the corner. Um, but they want a CNC jobbing machine because their operators are familiar with CNC. Mm -hmm. Um, but we're also looking at an awful lot of companies who don't have CNC and they need to get into the market um, and at the low end and, and they're looking at an investment of they don't want to be spending 30 or 40 thousand pounds on a machine um, because they're not sure how it can earn them more money mm -hmm. which is one of the things that we've done on this particular model as well is we've given um, a by the hour price because they can cost a machine in to then work out how much they're going to earn on their jobs and they can work out that you can get a very very quick payback on a CNC machine. And I guess it's great for education not only at colleges and universities but if you've got an apprenticeship program why tie up an 80, 90, 100,000 pound machine tool when you could pretty much give them one of these couldn't you? Well we're not going to give them one but uh, yes you can do <laughs> by all means if you like um, but you're right it is and it does fit into a, a different level of a market you're quite right why would you tie in a, a 50, 60,000 pound machine that you don't have to mm -hmm. it's the principle of two axis turning which is, is what they need to know and also the programming finesse but it doesn't matter if it's a, a high volume a slant bed lathe or a simple flatbed CNC mm -hmm. So as ever Ian Selling the machine is probably the easiest bit, but you've also got full coverage across the UK as well. Yes, we have a, a full service package that's uh, covered from both ends of the country. Um, we've got a uh, service base down in Limington on the south coast, which covers basically the southern part of the country with our engineers. And, and we're currently in Noon Engineering Services building up in Manchester in Stockport. Um, and they have their own engineers, which can also cover for service, warranty, installations, and yes, we do cover the whole country.